Operation Guide for Beyond Bi-Level Portable Ventilator B19. Welcome to use Beyond Medical Ventilator. For our non-invasive ventilator, we have CPAP, Auto CPAP, and a BiPAP. Now I will show you the operation of our BiPAP B19. One, equipment composition. Our accessories include the traveling bag, host, water chamber, power adapter, tube, headgear, full face mask, user manual, three-way connector, and the inlet filter. Two, the use of humidifier. The humidifier works by heating the water to provide a proper warm and humid airflow to avoid the discomfort caused by dry airflow. When using humidifier, we recommend to use our original tube to avoid leakage. If you don't need humidity function, please adjust the humidifier level to zero. Clean the water chamber. Remove the water chamber parallel to the right and wash it separately. Please wash with neutral detergent. Rinse with flowing water and fully dry. Add water to water chamber. Before adding water, make sure the water tank is clean and there's no water outside the tank. Add distilled water or purified water. In winter, if need the human airflow, we recommend to add the water less than 35 degrees. Please keep the water line under the maximum line marked on the water chamber. Install water chamber. Keep the water chamber parallel. Push it to the end until matching the host outlet connector. Please do not flip or tilt the machine after installing a filtered water chamber to avoid water flowing into the host. Please don't touch the heating plate. 3. Install and wear for the headgear and mask. 1. Remove the two buckles of mask first and insert the two lower sides of headgear into the mask buckles. Fix an appropriate position. 2. Insert the two upper sides of the headgear into the holes of the mask forehead and fix in the approximate position. Wear the headgear into the proper position on the head. Gently put the mask on face. Adjust the mask length according to face. Snap the two lower buckles into the fixing rods. 3. Adjusting the mask position and headgear tightness to let you convert, but no leaking. Rotate the forehead infinitely fine-tuner according to your needs to adjust a suitable height. 4. Adjust headgear position to ensure it average distribute in left and right. The upper and lower headgear are parallel. The mask easily fits the face. 5. The mask has been worn. You don't need repeatedly adjusting the mask length and headgear tightness for the next time, only snapping the buckles into the lower side fixing rods. 4. Device Connection 1. Install the air inlet filter. Connect the non-wall type power supply. 2. Wear the mask and headgear. 3. Connect the tube, one side to the water chamber outlet and the other side to the mask inlet. 4. Connect the non-wall power supply. 5. Buttons and functions. There are two buttons on the host available for operation. 1. On and off button. After connecting with the power supply, the indicator light will be on. 2. Shadow flying. It can be rotated clockwise, counterclockwise to adjust the parameters. Press the shadow flying to confirm. When screen backlight is off, press any button to activate the screen backlight. 3. Power outage alarm. When the device power off in working state, it will give a buzzing alarm lasting for about 30 seconds. During the alarm, press the on and off button or connecting power supply again, alarm will stop and it will return the normal working status. 4. Main interface and operation. When setting the parameters, please follow doctor advice or other doctor and agent's professional guidance. The main interface displays the date time, work mode, working pressure, and five sub-interfaces for setting parameters. Rotate the shadow flying button on main interface. Highlight cursor is for choosing sub-menu. Press shadow flying button to enter the corresponding sub-interface. 
The first SAP interface displayed real-time pressure and airflow data. P is pressure, F is airflow. WM is current working mode, BPM is breath per minute, IE is in separation time and expiration time proportion, VT is tidal volume, LK is leakage volume, MV is minute ventilation volume. The second interface is for setting working parameters. Move the cursor to working mode icon. Press shuttle button without releasing for about 5 seconds. Until you hear the top left lock icon will disappear and system enter into parameter setting interface. To ensure the safety of users, you have to unlock the device firstly before setting the important parameters. There are four work modes for our B19, CCAM, ST, and ST. In each mode, the adjustable parameters are different. The user can select the working mode as required and then adjusting the corresponding parameters. Now I will introduce the ST mode and CPAP mode. The other modes can refer to these two modes. ST mode you can see. Auto on and off. Ramp 0 to 60 minutes can be set according to user's requirements. If no need, please put in 0 though. Mode ST. IPAP, EPAP, 4 to 25 centimeters H2O. The IPAP should be higher than EPAP. Eye slope, E sense, 1 to 6 level. The smaller the value, the higher the sensibility. BPM, 4 to 40 BPM. Inspiration time, 0.5 to 3.0 seconds. CPAP mode you can see, auto on and off. Ramp. 0 to 60 minutes. Mode CPAP. Setting pressure 4 to 20 cm H2O. Balix 0 to 3 level. The other manufacturer may call it EPR. Each option can be adjusted according to the requirements. Details as following. Rotate the shadow flying button to the parameter need to be adjusted. Press the shadow flying button in the highlight status. Rotate the shadow flying button to the appropriate working mode or parameter. Press the shadow flying button again to confirm. Rotating shadowing flying button to the top right corner X close icon. Press it back to the main interface. After the parameters are set, press the on and off button. The device will start running. The third interface is humidifier setting. Our humidifier has 0 to 5 level for option. The higher level, the higher temperature. Level 0, off. Level 1, 45 Celsius degrees. Level 2, 50 Celsius degrees. Level 3, 55 Celsius degrees. Level 4, 60 Celsius degrees. Level 5, 65 Celsius degrees. The fourth interface is System Parameters Setting. Set the date, time, backlight time, total therapy time, use time, and effective treatment days. The fifth interface is the Appwerf test form. There are eight questions. Rotate the shuttle flying key to answer questions. Press to confirm. After finishing all questions, move to OK and confirm system would show the test result automatically. The users can refer to the result and make a rough adjustment treatment. Introduction of interface icons. This icon indicating USB has been connected. This icon indicating that the humidifier is working. This icon indicating the blower is working. This icon indicating that the ramp has been set. This icon indicating that the important parameters are locked. They cannot be modified now. Unlock steps. Move the cursor to parameter setting icon on main interface. Press and hold the shadow button until you're hearing a bustle alarm. 6. Cleaning and maintenance. Disconnect the power supply of the device before cleaning and maintenance. 1. Host cleaning. Remove the humidifier in parallel. 
Place the machine on a dry and ventilated, stable surface to avoid direct sunlight. Make sure the power is off and the plug is unplugged before cleaning. Immerse the cloth with clean water or neutral detergent. Dry it when wiping the front panel and outer shell. Please avoid the liquid flowing into the device during cleaning. Do not beat or disassemble the device. If any problem, please contact the after-sale department. 2. Water Chamber Cleaning Take out the water chamber from the host after cooling the water. Please use the pure water. Tap water may lead to scale. Water line shouldn't over the max line. Change water every day. Check the humidifier regularly and use the neutral detergent to do the cleaning. Do not move the machine drastically or turn over the machine when there is water inside the water chamber. If there is some mineral precipitation inside, please add the vinegar to immerse about 10 minutes and then use the water or the distilled water to rinse it. 3. Tube Cleaning Suggest to clean the tube every week with neutral detergent. Dry it in shade and store it in a dry ventilated place. Avoid high temperature, strong sunlight, and scratching. Tube is consumables. We suggest replacing it with our original parts once a year. If adding leakage, please replace it at once. 4. Mask Cleaning Mask is consumables. We suggest replacing it with our original parts every 6 months. If any damage, please replace it at once. Please clean it with neutral detergent every 2 or 3 days. Dry it in shade and store it in a dry, ventilated place. The cushion is easily to be yellow. Please clean it with neutral detergent. Avoid high temperature, strong sunlight and scratching. The tube and mask are for personal use to avoid infection. Do not share them with others. 5. Cleaning and Replacement Please remember to install the filter before turning on, cleaning it every week, replacing it every three months. Do not install a wet filter. Beyond Medical, make good medical devices. More details, please just contact us. We also produce sandwich pump, infusion pump, nurse calling system, dental equipment, and dental orthodontic pliers and so on.